Hello. If one will take a look at the world around yourself today, it is in a constant state of disarray. And it doesn't matter what state you live in or what country, there is something not right with the world. And although organized religion is not the cause of this, it certainly has not helped matters. The history of organized religion in the world, whether it be Christian or Jewish or Muslim or Hindu or Buddhist or anything in between long forgotten or so small people don't even know it to mention, organized religion has failed epically. Organized religion has given birth to the welfare state, or the failure of organized religion has given birth to the welfare state. It's given birth to the nanny state. It's given birth to this ingrained separation and fear of people you don't know. Organized religion has robbed the masses, enriched the elite, and along the way has degraded the human condition to such an extent that humans do not even remember what it's like to be human. If the church had not failed, people would be loving their neighbor. And that doesn't mean some fuzzy feeling. That is making sure your neighbor has enough to eat, making sure your neighbor has clothing, making sure that the children are taken care of, making sure that the elderly and the widows are taken care of. But the church does not emphasize this. The organized religions emphasize coming to your house of worship, praying, giving money, and apparently gossiping, backbiting, obesity, and the message of you know, whether it be Jesus or Mohammed or Moses or the Buddha or Krishna has been lost. So organized religion is relevant today only in that it has allowed people to become complacent. It has allowed people to actually lose their way, but it is no longer helpful. Organized religion no longer offers a solution. And although the wisdom contained in the quote-unquote inspiration for organized religion may be useful, the organization itself is actually now part of the problem. Thank you.